What's up, everybody? We are now in Hollywood and we're heading towards Los Angeles. We are on Beverly, heading east. <laughs> Give you guys a tour of Los Angeles area. Not sure how I'm gonna get out of this one. I guess I could just go around the block. Go straight. Or slam on it when the guitar light turns green. <laughs> Hopefully this guy falls asleep, I can just like fly ahead. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna go this way. Oh, Welcome to Los Angeles area. Mm -hmm. That wasn't too bad. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> I can't believe that doesn't have 24s on already. Who goes there to turn? No, spam. <coughs> I don't want that pamperish down there. Pam, pam. That pamperish down there. Yeah. So that's the phone that's got all the homeless stuff. We're still in Hollywood, so I can still use that phone for my other bit of those homeless. That that Paris down there. All right, for seeing homeless people, we can do it on this one. Okay. So, mm -hmm. welcome to Rush Hour, Los Angeles. This will be a blast. Mm -hmm. I'm a Hollywood. You never explained if it was Hollywood, Florida or Hollywood, California. It's Hollywood, California. <coughs> no, the Mecha song. Oh, I don't know. You're like, Mama Pa Hollywood. Which one? Mm -hmm. Oh, this is going to be fun. Mm -hmm. First, we're going to go to Skid Row. Mm -hmm. I haven't done a Skid Row in the daytime. Or we could just throw it south central and then get to the hotel. Wanna do that? Mm -hmm. Skip on skip on skid row. Mm -hmm. It's gonna we're gonna have to after the rain passes, we're gonna have to head to San Francisco. Mm -hmm. Tomorrow might just be an all driving day. We're never gonna do it otherwise. Like we've been here for Yeah, I know. That's what I'm saying. That's <coughs> why I'm like, eh. There's no way we can do this city all in one day. If we lived here, mm -hmm. if it we would take lived months. here, it would take in a year you wouldn't cover everything. Yeah. So we have to be realistic at some point and say, okay, this is what we can afford to do. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You want to take the coastline tomorrow, like Malibu to Monterey? If it's raining, it might be a good driving day. <laughs> Maybe just take the five to... <laughs> mm -hmm. yeah. What's that tonight? Mm -hmm. Let's see what tomorrow's like. <sighs> A Japanese sushi bar. H V Y industry. We all right. Why does that even matter? Why do you need all races welcome in your business? What is it like 1864 or something? <clears throat> Why is that even a relevant sign? Well, this will be a fun video to watch. Oh, it's in the traffic jam. Dang it. Hollywood. How is that even relevant? Look at that sign. We welcome all races. Mm -hmm. All. We gotta get full though. That is the most ridiculous thing I've ever seen. What are they doing? Window tinting? Mm -hmm. Why does a window tinting. Personal training? It's a gym. I think it's a gym. I think they're doing window tinting. No, it's a gym. This is full of smog and hate. 
Why would that even be a sign? That's so weird. I worked at LA Fitness. Nobody asks you what anything. race you are to go jogging. You just jogging. are there to work out. Yeah, if you're fat, you need to run. I don't care what color you are. You're you're fat. Now I don't I don't care if you're fat. I don't like you either way. I hate all fat people. No one cares. They're there to work it out. They're not looking around. The I, gym. Are you kidding me? What is this, Florida? Oh my gosh. Got that, that floor down there. Yeah. Beverly Tailoring. If you're working out, you're this not feels looking like at other people. this feels like a Hialeah. This is Beverly Hills. Mm -hmm. This is supposed to be like some fancy area. This feels like Hialeah to me, bro. This is like shady because look at there's like bars on the windows and. It doesn't feel like a ritzy area. It feels like a like a Hialeah. It feels like the hood. Not ex yeah, some some things do. <laughs> it's not, but it, it's still For like. This, like built up area <coughs> where they put it on the media it looks kind of shady Beverly you've got metal bars it's a urban it's a densely populated urban area it is but like they make it sound like it's like the fanciest place on earth Naples is fancier than this yeah this Naples is definitely classier than this it may not be as big or as famous but Naples is definitely classier this place is like oh mm -hmm. yeah this is a complete dump no, it's not a complete dump. It's a nice urban area, but it's not like all it's drawn. You know what I mean? Like, hmm. Oh, in Downey, there's a Vallarta supermarket. Hmm. 529. Yeah. Echale ganas. Not that gas price. <laughs> You know what this reminds me of? La Pequeña Havana. Mm -hmm. A little Havana in Miami is cleaner than this. Definitely more clean than this. This is kind of like dingy. Erewhon. Where all the celebrities shop. Really? Yeah, it's like one of those trendy grocery stores. Oh, it's a grocery store. Mm -hmm. I thought it was like a clothing yeah. store. I almost went in to buy some shoes, right? I guess not. No. This looks like 8th Street in Miami. Mm -hmm. Or uh, Biscayne in Miami or something. Mm -hmm. This looks like Northwest Miami. This looks like Northeast Miami. That's what this looks like. Mm -hmm. Every once in a while, Lambo drives by or something, you know, and then you know you're in a ritzy area. But other than that. I see fancier cars on a daily basis where I live. Yeah. It's like, it's like what? <coughs> What's an apartment out here run? Ah! 25 to 3, 35. So a little bit more than what we pay. No. Or quite a bit more. Just a little bit 50% more than me. Well, this reminds me of it's Miami. Mm -hmm. I expected, like, super elegant and refined. You know, like, this has a street feel to it, you know? Mm -hmm. It really does. It feels like coyote and Mexican food. That looks cool. I'm sure that's really good. Yeah. It's like a really old time. Coyote. That sounds good. It's definitely not what I expected, I'll tell you that much. Yeah. Agnes. No traffic going that way either. Yeah. That's hilarious. All traffic's going back in the alley. Yeah. If we were driving the other way, yeah. it would be a life changing thing. But I already booked the thing. I don't know. And plus, there's cooler things in Downey. Well, if we get that, um, if we get that, um, rain come through, mm -hmm. we're gonna be stuck in LA or driving to San Francisco. But it's snowing, that rain turns into snow in San Francisco. Mm -hmm. At least, like, I'll be able to wear my regular clothes. I'm, I haven't been able to wear my regular clothes because everything that I have supposed to be not supposed to wear here, but I doubt it's like that. I mean, I really starting to feel like that I was all hype and crap because I haven't felt unsafe at all. Yeah. 
Like, I felt more unsafe in, like... That Cerrito place was scary. Yeah. When we first came into California, that little town in the middle of the woods? Yeah. That was bad. This feels normal. Mm. I see a lot of Hebrew writing. A lot of writing I in Hebrew. I think we're in like a little Armenia or something. Perfect. Beverly Center. Beverly Boulevard, baby. Look at one of those little food things. Mm -hmm. The food delivery robots. Is if you chase one. The what? The food delivery robot. They'll interact with you. Really? Yeah. How do they interact with you? Like they tell you to leave them alone or they're working or something? Yeah. Now they'll tell you they're going to work or something. I watched the whole documentary on I never thought I'd ever see one working, but yeah, they're everywhere. They're food delivery robots. Should like get in its way. <laughs> Well, we did earlier. It like backed off. It was scared of our car. Yeah. It was like it saw me driving like across three lanes. Mhm. Mm it was like this is dangerous. <laughs> That's an Arizona license plate over there. So we're gonna go south on Normandy. That's one of the main streets we haven't done yet. Yeah. So when you get to Morgany, we'll go south. Yeah. Actually, I guess you just don't realize how fancy Florida is until you go out there and see other places that are so-called quote-unquote fancy. Okay, I like this a little bit more right here. Mm -hmm. More residential. Was born in Camagüey. Alright, we're moving now. Probably want to go to the left. Because it's coming up. Is it? Yeah. Once you pass Western, it's the next street. Well, we can take Western too if you want. We already did a Western video at night. You want to do it no, that time? No, it's the next big street after Western, is what I'm saying. It's a parallel to Okay. Yeah. I just want to go on the skid row before we go to the hotel and see it in the daytime. Yeah. It did really well. It might be worth doing another round up in there. Mm -hmm. It'll get more views. And then we can do... How about we do this? Let's switch it up. Let's do skid row East LA. Mm -hmm. I don't know. I don't know. It's up to you. Look it up. Figure it out. What makes sense? I've always wanted to see East LA because of that East LA song. I was born in East LA. Huh? That camera was accept <laughs> acceptable. Mm -hmm. We're in Los Angeles and it's not like it's Miami. Mm -hmm. Everything is so expensive. You'll spend more money here than you can imagine. There's no making a budget to be in the city. It's still a half an hour to Skid Row. Oh, wow. So that's just going straight into downtown. Mm hmm. I think we should do that Normandy Street. But Normandy, you're going to lose time on that one too because that's not taking you straight. You know what I'm saying? Like, I was born in Kama Way. Actually, you'd be just fine on Normandy. How about we do Figueroa Street? That's a fun street. No, let's go with the original plan in Normandy. Well, that wasn't a plan, it was a suggestion. <laughs> original plan, so say. 
That was not an original plan. That was a mere suggestion. Let me see my rubber. Do that to your van. <laughs> yeah, we'll, we'll go into Los Angeles. And then from here, 25 minutes. This time of day, everything is going to be complicated and time consuming. You realize that, right? Yes. Nothing is not going to be time consuming this yeah. morning. I don't like to deviate from my original plans. Well, too bad. Too dang bad. It's if you watch this channel, you will find that out about me very quickly. I do not like to deviate from the original plan. Well, do you know what? Sometimes you have to adapt. I know. I will adapt. I just don't like it. All right, we'll do Normandy. Mm -hmm. <coughs> We're lucky it hasn't started raining. It was supposed to start raining yeah. a long time ago. Mm -hmm. We really lucked out with the rain. Yeah. Man, it's so sick, Miami. Oh, wow, that was so close. If I did not touch the brake, immediately realize what that car did. There's no way that wasn't going to be an accident. That was so close. You have no idea. Skid Row. We're gonna take Beverly all the way in the downtown and then we're gonna do Skid Row. It's more important, it's gonna make us more money. Okay. This is so cool. Yeah. Look how beautiful this is. It's not like it's like beautiful from a city perspective. It's so yes. complex and I mean, there's so much yeah. going on. Mm -hmm. This looks like Miami, bro. Yeah. You you, you kill with mine. Cool, man. Mm -hmm. <coughs> the tip was another one, I think we're going to go through um, Chinatown, is on this side of downtown, right? Mm -hmm. I mean, we got to do their Chinatown, it's on this side before we get to Skid Row. I think it starts up ahead. Let me see the map real quick. Either Chinatown or Koreatown, there's one of the two on, on this side, oh. I'm Koreatown. To the southwest is Koreatown. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna guess it's probably like larger than just the neighborhood boundaries. We need to skip around 22 minutes. Head east on Beverly Boulevard toward North Kingsley Drive. This route avoids <coughs> a slowdown on US 101 South. You are on the fastest route. You will arrive at 4.30 p.m. What a cool urban center. Continue on Beverly Boulevard for half a mile. If I didn't step on the brake right that second, that was a guaranteed accident. Squatted. <laughs> that that quat down here. Wow, this looks so much like Miami. It's incredible. Got that quat down there.
Head east on Beverly Boulevard toward North Alexandria Avenue. Okay, Beverly, all the way in the downtown. Pollos a la brasa. Y a la y al abrazo también, hay que abrazar los pollos, mi hermano. Oh, look how cool this looks. This is so cool, look at this. This is the city view right here. All the buildings are different colors. There's people and garbage and cars yeah. and buses and lights and signs. This is the city right here. Yeah. Jollibee, that's that, um, what's it called? Uh, that restaurant I was telling you about. You know, I expected more graffiti murals in the city. That, it's Philippines. It's from the Philippines, Jollibee. There's one in Tampa. In a quarter mile, turn right to stay on Beverly Boulevard. Mm -hmm. Is it me or did I expect more graffiti murals in the city? And come away. Probably all the way to Skid Row. Mm -hmm. Or Skid Row in the daytime. Mm -hmm. It's a nighttime video. It's already off to a great start. In 1,000 feet, <coughs> turn right to stay on Beverly Boulevard. Look at all that. Wow. Wow. That's a huge camp right there. Let me get back in there. Oh, crap. You're not going to be able to. You're not going to be able to. Yeah. You're going to have to turn right. To stay on Gotcha. Let me see what I can do up ahead. That's like a like a tent city looking template, I'll tell you what. Yeah. Grammy back in there. There's a bunch of homeless camps back there, aren't there? Huh? There's a homeless camps on that road. Because <coughs> you got to get over there. You can see the mountains if you look that way. Look. Yeah. Mm. People have actually climbed all the way up there to get those graffiti stickers on that sign. Mm -hmm. I know I got to get over in the other lane, but I don't, I don't know how I'm going to pull this off. You have to this guy try. fell asleep. Yeah, this guy fell asleep. Yeah, you have to de strike. I'm going on this guy fell asleep. Mm -hmm. Come forward, buddy. You've got a car length in front of him. Maybe mm -hmm. He's got a car length in front of him, but he's purposely being a a, a come bro. Yeah. Oh look at the bus is gonna hit him. Bus is gonna hit him. Mm -hmm. Bus ain't gonna play those games. Bus is not gonna play those games. Mm -hmm. I gotta get in that turning lane still, but there's not enough space. These cars are coming too quick. He gonna play games with that school bus. That school bus gonna tear his car apart. Oh, this car goes. I can get over. Oh, 
play those games with that school bus. <laughs> oh, he's like right on the edge. <laughs> Just arrogant piece of craps. <laughs> that school bus gonna tear that fender off, bro. Turn right to stay on Beverly Boulevard. Look at this mirror right here. <laughs> I was born and got my way. He's doing what I think he's doing. I thought it would look trashier in the city. Mm. It really took me off guard how like kind of mm -hmm. like it's not as fancy as I thought it would be, and it's also not as trashy yeah. as I thought. It, like it's more of a of a middle ground. Like it's not as trashy. As I was expecting. Mm -hmm. But it's also not as clean as I was expecting. It's, it was, it's more of a middle ground both ways. Like, I expected the hoods to be dirtier. Mm -hmm. And I expected the rich ears to be richier. Yeah. Like, I didn't really see that it's, it's more of a middle ground. <coughs> I also didn't expect on this side, heading towards Beverly, that it would be so much homelessness, graffiti, and grimy crap looking crap on this side over here. I thought this would all be like super fancy. Yeah. They make it out like it's like gold lined streets. I think the, the word not. is overrated. Yeah. In every aspect. Uh huh. You know, the traffic even is overrated. It's about what every other. Yeah. Have you ever been stuck in Miami and Northwest Miami at this time of day? Mm -hmm. That's aggravating. Mm -hmm. At least here it's a constantly changing yeah. theme, you know? Mm -hmm. You go from buildings to graffiti to stores. Yeah. Like it's a constantly changing scenario. That Miami, but you get stuck in them yep. traffic jams. It's You're like just one there. thing Bye. over and over again. That's game related right there. Mm. That's a bold color to wear in the city. Mm -hmm. That one's burning blue and white. Mm -hmm. And uh, supposedly you're not supposed to wear that. Yeah. They don't look like they're on the street, so they just look like a regular civilian. Mm -hmm. and it's Even that whole thing is like way too overrated. Mm -hmm. like, people really exaggerate every aspect of the city. Like, there's five people over there wearing blue. Yeah. And they're like old ladies. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, people over exaggerate every. This is the most ex over rated city in every aspect, from the good to the bad, all the way around. It's just an overrated city. It really is. <coughs> it's just overrated all the way around. This neighborhood looks interesting. It's a shame. But like I said, if we lived in this city, you couldn't cover it all. Yeah. If we lived here year round. And our full-time job was just a video. We couldn't see it all. So it's, it's unrealistic that in the limited yeah. time that we have, we're going to see it all. That's what I was trying to say. Mm. It's like, like, I'm looking at, you're like talking about like how you want to cover everything. And I'm like, you know, we don't have enough time in the day, hours. Mm. You know, there are more places that have a lot of the things that we're looking for. It's like I wanted to get into Washington, Oregon. They're already getting snowed out. We'll see. We will see what the weather actually does. 
and go from there. Well, it's, it's snowing. That's what the weather does here. I'm not really sure where you're going with this. It's snowing. <laughs> it's like, like well, I'm not giving up on my dream so I'm easily. Like, <laughs> I'm like, it's snowing. She's like, well, let's see what the weather does. I'm like, it's already doing it. It's... Hey, as long as it's ground, snow, we're all right. Yeah. yeah, it's not gonna be floating in the air. It's gonna be ground for sure. Yeah, I think all snow is gonna be on the ground, Katie. No, like if it's gonna be actively snowing. Like storms and I think we're all right. Dad's gonna have a heart attack because he's gonna hear that it's snowing in the news in California. He's like, I'm up all my babies in the snow. My baby's gonna be cold. <laughs> I better call him to make sure he's wearing a coat. <laughs> yeah. That is his dad. That's alright. Like, it, it, Jose will be in California and his dad will be like, all my babies in the cold. Now I had to wear a sweater. All right, Katie. Enough. Do you want me yeah. to start on your mother? <laughs> Do you want me to get started on your mother? Then be quiet. Honor your father and my father. Okay. You better shut up with that. Oh. You don't. You don't talk bad about him when he's cooking for you. I never said I didn't like him. Teach him how to cook Cuban food. Imagine if he hadn't taught you how to cook Cuban food. There ain't no telling what type of relationship we'll be having right now. Jose. What? I didn't cook Maybe for none. You. I didn't cook for you for like the first ten years yeah. because the first times I did cook for you, you were throwing like throwing it against the wall. Yeah. Yeah. You didn't even try it. You were throwing it against the wall. And we're like, it's not Cuban. <laughs> yeah. Wanna keep going with this? You can walk back to Florida. <laughs> I think it's you that would be walking back to Florida. Oh, look at the look he's giving Why are you picking me. on me? Go away. Because it's fun. You pick at me all the time. I pick at you once. And then I it's... Know. Give me a drink. <laughs> and he, he's smiling, so he likes it. Go away. Mm -hmm. Give me a drink. I'm doing that to you. Oh, you so bloody. <laughs> Vallarta. We'll go there when you can pronounce it properly. How about that? Vallarta. I'm saying it right. Is there water? <coughs> no, but we can get some lager fresh because at the Vallarta supermarket. Why are you saying it properly now? This guy parked his truck in the middle road. Where did Lily plumb Yeah. Gotta do what you gotta do. Cause it's not funny anymore. Filipino town! In 800 nice. feet, keep left to stay on Beverly Boulevard. Not bad. Mm -hmm. well, like I said. Impossible to see all this city in one day, mm -hmm. or even in a week. It, it, like I said, you could probably be a whole year in this in the city, mm -hmm. and won't be able to do it. Also, so you just gotta get confirmed for what we've done, mm -hmm. and we can always come back again. That's what I've been trying to say. It doesn't feel as far when you leave them wanting more. Mm. In six hundred feet, keep left to stay on Beverly Boulevard. It won't feel far until you're heading back. Yeah. Crap, I thought I'd reach it three days ago. Heading back in the snow. Left, I'm, I'm a left, right, keep going over. A little bit left, just stay. Continue for one and a half miles. You're good. Oh, skid row, make some skid row videos. I don't know how, we probably have 50 videos. We're going to have to do, we're going to have to delete them as soon as they're up, delete. Mm -hmm. We can't, we have to upload the link, upload the link, because we've made, recorded yeah, yeah. so many videos. But I don't think we're, we're going to be able to do it all. Mm -hmm. Katie, show me your orchata. I'll be getting some. 
there's like three types of hot chocolate, a bunch of types of hot chocolate over there. I'm gonna try them all. I love when you're like the one that was like hillbilly acting. Like, hot tip, 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 tip. You know, talking about tip, back, my life at the supermarket. Why do you like hop into like a hick mode? You're like, it's fun. Hick. Whenever hick. I'm excited to something, the hick comes out of me. She's just like, hick, tip, hick, tip, 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 I won't oh, go oh, see what oh, tamales oh. they have. Spike. Car's the one donuts. Where was it? Right here. I want to see. What, can I talk to her? Um, yeah, I want to go see what tamales they have. They got pasteles. Pasteles. I said pasteles. They got pet cat down there. I said pasteles. Pet cat. They got pet they got a hot chocolate bar. They got a hot drink bar. Oh, that's a dirty parking lot. I want to go try it. That's, a, that's as dirty as parking lot in Alabama. Oh, well, aren't you progressive? You're just like Alabama. Right, dude, that's a filthy parking lot. How far are you from Skid Row? Nine minutes. Still nine minutes? Wow. Yeah. I had no idea if Beverly went this far in. I can't believe our phones are able to store this much memory. Yes, sir. <laughs> now, this is this hotel we know has good internet. It should be enough to get all these videos off. Continue think. on West yeah. First Street for half a mile. You're going to turn right on San Pedro. Yeah, and you're going to yeah. be pretty much in. Why are you talking like a hick all of a sudden? Well, I'm talking like me. I'm talking yeah, like me. Get the lamp paper. When I get excited, I start talking like this. So let me talk like this. Let me talk, let me talk like this. My name is Mary from Virginia. You done? Are you dead? Are you done? Is you done or are you done? What was it that Birdman would say? Is you done or is you done yet? No, that's not how it went. Is you done or is you done? Oh, uh, we're not on Beverly anymore. Now we're on first. Alright y'all, that's the end of Beverly video. Hope you guys liked it.